So what is the justification for triangle ABC being congruent to triangle ZXY? Again, justifying why these two triangles are congruent based off of the facts only. So the first fact that I have in this picture is I want to start off by talking about angle C. Notice how angle C is congruent to angle Y. Then also notice how angle A is congruent to angle Z. And then the last fact that I have is side AB is congruent to side ZX. So in this picture, we have an angle, an angle, and a side. Now, notice how the side that is marked is not an included side, and that is okay. When we go and we mark our picture, what I like to do is I like to start, start somewhere and either go clockwise or counterclockwise. Um, I typically like to go, if I start here, I want to go what is, what, is, what is the next closest. So if I start at angle C, my next closest thing that I have marked is angle A, and then last is side BA. If I go the other direction, I have side BA, then next I'm gonna to go to, to angle A, and then last to angle C. The direction that we go in and the way we have it marked is important whenever we make our triangle congruency justification. So angle, angle, side is the reason why these two triangles are congruent. So triangle ABC is congruent to triangle ZXY by AAS.